Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing all the hiding spots I know in MM2 and the middle base map, so I hope you guys enjoy. The first one is over here, behind the crates. It's pretty good, murder cannot see you unless they go back here. And for this one too, they cannot see you, so I would rate this a 8 out of 10. The next one is over here in the pole. If you just use shift lock or first person, you can slide in here and there you go. Now, if the murder does not know this spot, this is a really good one. Um, if you have big accessories, though, they may stick through. Butts can kill you through the walls really easily, so 5 out of 10. Next is over here, behind the crates. This one is pretty good. Um, they probably won't see you unless you have big accessories. It might stick over the top, but uh, I think it'll be fine otherwise than that. Um, it's pretty good. 7 out of 10. Okay, so the next one is over here behind the door. It's pretty good, but there's a window here, so you will most likely be seen. And if you have big accessories like me, it will stick to the wall or the door. So I would rate this a 4 out of 10. The next one is over here in the showers. Now, I wouldn't really recommend it because murder can easily kill you by going in here and you're dead. So 3 out of 10. The next one is in the lockers. Now, if you have big accessories like me, they're going to stick to the wall and the murderer will kill you. So, for me, it's not that good, but for people, for people that don't have big accessories, this one's really good, unless the murderer knows it. So, 4 out of 10. The next one is over here behind these. I would only use this if the murderer is chasing you down the hallway and you don't want to get hit by the knife. I would just sit behind here and then keep moving when they throw the knife. So it's not really a hiding spot. Uh, 3 out of 10. The next hiding spot is over here or over here. Not a good hiding spot at all because Murder can easily see you through here and uh, will easily kill you. So wouldn't really recommend it at all. 1 out of 10. So the next one is behind here. Um, I've spectated before, not many people go to check this spot anymore, so it's kind of good. Um, you can also juke possibly if you squeeze through here, and yeah, it's pretty good. Murder can't see you unless they go over here, so I would say a 7 out of 10. Next one is over here. It's pretty good. Most people use this just to juke the murder or just to do a temporary hiding place. Most people go up here to check, and murder can easily kill you, so I'm going to rate this a 4 out of 10. So the next one is over here. Now, it is pretty good, but you can easily get killed here because there's nowhere to go, and you can shoot the murder. So, 3 out of 10. The next one is this one over here. It's good. It's just a wall. I mean, you can juke the murder if you jump off and go over here onto the crates. If you get lucky, um, sometimes you can't make it, so not a very good spot. Um, 4 out of 10. The next hiding spot is over here. It's good, it's just a temporary spot, so 3 out of 10. The next hiding spot is over here. Um, it's really good. Um, you can easily trick the murderer by jumping over here and they might not see you, so 7 out of 10. The next one is over here in the vents. It's good, not the best. Murder can throw a knife at you. So, 6 out of 10. That was the, all the hiding spots I know from Millbase. And like and subscribe if you want to see part 3. See ya!